If all you're hearing is crickets, it can be very frustrating and disheartening. And the reason no one's buying often boils down to just one thing. Here you'll discover the number one reason why customers aren't buying. How's it going? This is Jeff over at 10tononline.com where I help business owners untangle the web so they can build and grow their projects themselves. All right, now without sales, you don't have a business, right? If your stuff isn't selling, then you don't have any profits. And if you don't have any profits, then you don't have a business, right? Instead, what you have is a hobby or a job that you don't get paid to do just yet. And this can all be very frustrating and disheartening. I know exactly how frustrating and disheartening it can be. After all, people might say that they like your stuff. They might say that it's great, but when it comes right down to it, nobody buys. This is totally deflating and frustrating. Why? Why aren't people buying? Well, the biggest reason why they aren't buying is because they're skeptical. We live in a very skeptical world. Thanks to shameless advertising that promises fast, easy fixes and products that don't deliver, we've been conditioned to distrust product claims, businesses and marketers, even the ethical ones. This is why one of the worst things a business can say in its messaging is we're number one or we're the best. Really? If they were really the best, would they need to shout it from the rooftops? Would they really need to put it all over their ads? Wouldn't the rest of us already know that they were number one? Why do they need to tell us that they're number one? And so this creates skepticism. People don't believe ads or marketing and businesses because they hear these sorts of messages all the time. Is there a different approach though? An approach that shows that you care. An approach that dissolves skepticism and builds trust instead. It's easy to say we're the best. It's easy to feed into more skepticism. It's a lot harder to build trust trust, which is why so few build great businesses that other people actually care about. So listen, where to from here? Well, that's a great question. All this business and web design and marketing stuff can be really tough, really tricky to sort out. This is why I've put together a clear, simple, and easy to follow online workshop just for you over at 10tononline.com forward slash free. There you'll learn about the 10 components. I call these the 10 web building blocks that you're going to need to not only build and run your business and your website, but to maintain it and promote it long term to your audience and to the people that you want to serve and help. You'll learn about some of the common mistakes and pitfalls that trip a lot of people up. And you'll also find out about some of the best tools that you can use to get yourself started the right way. <laughs> but hurry, this workshop might not be available for much longer. Grab it while you can over at 10tononline.com forward slash free. I will see you there.